A viewer raised an issue that I hadn't planned to discuss since it was not part of the original Defending the Resurrection manuscript, but since it was raised and may be useful, I'll go ahead and elaborate on it. The first point to make is to highlight these two words. The first one is a Greek word used for any act of getting up or rising, as in even getting up from your chair. The second one, which we saw previously, refers to the specific process of resurrection. You can see they're related, and it's not hard to also see that the second word describes an event that is a specific type of the first word, while obviously not exhausting its full semantic range. A second point is that some have claimed that the second word has been used in pagan literature of non-Jewish risings from the dead, unlike that of Jesus. Well, no, not really. The evidence of that is, at best, equivocal. Here are the examples that were once raised by a critic of the argument. The same critic once noted that this word is used over 30 times in extant pagan literature before the time of Christ, and he asked if we were to believe that these were all in reference to what was conceptually Jewish resurrection. Unfortunately, the one thing the critic didn't do was analyze or present any of those 30 instances to show that any of them did not refer to a Jewish type of resurrection. I'm still waiting for that proof, and I probably will be for a while. 